So this is the story of Rubisco, which is the most disappointing enzyme. We all know the equation for photosynthesis, where you have light, water, and carbon dioxide, and it makes sugar and oxygen. We have the light-dependent reactions, where the light and the water are involved, and there are the light-independent reactions. This part is called the Calvin cycle. And I want to focus on this step that I've circled in yellow here, where the carbon is introduced into the process. Um, the step is called carbon fixation or carboxylation. You have a molecule called ribulose 1,5-bisphosphate, and you have carbon dioxide, which is inorganic carbon, and it becomes these two, three carbon sugar molecules. And this is a really important step because it's adding carbon to a biomolecule. Um, and carbon is so important for life because it makes those four covalent bonds that allow you to make really versatile and useful molecules. The enzyme that catalyzes this reaction is called ribulose 1,5-bisphosphate carboxylase oxygenase. Um, also known as Rubisco. And it's a really disappointing and bad enzyme. For one thing, this oxygenase part of its name refers to when it uses carbon dioxide, when it uses oxygen instead of carbon dioxide in the reaction. And that makes a molecule called phosphoglycolate. And phosphoglycolate is not useful. So the chloroplast has to use photorespiration to get rid of it. And photorespiration wastes energy. Um, and the bad thing about it is that it occurs one out of four times that Rubisco catalyzes the reactions. That, and that's really frequently for something that's so inefficient. Um, there are very way, various ways to look at the reason that photorespiration happens in the oxygenation. But in the end, it's just really wasteful for the cell. It's also a really slow enzyme. Most enzymes can work at a rate of about a thousand per second, some more, some less. But Rubisco works at a rate of about three or four per second, which is ridiculously slow. Um, because it's so slow, plants and other photosynthetic organisms have to produce a lot of Rubisco in order to produce enough sugar to keep them alive. Um, and so because it's so slow and because it's so inefficient, it's also the dumbest enzyme. So next time you do pretty much anything at all, you can remember that it's thanks to Rubisco uh, sitting in the chloroplasts and cyanobacteria doing a really horrible job at sustaining all life on Earth.